Good day, I'm Teacher V, your Teach Tech Buddy. For today's video, we will explore Padlet in student's perspective. How to upload in Padlet. What is Padlet? Padlet is a digital tool that can help teachers and students in class and beyond by offering a single place for a notice board. Padlet is a digital bulletin board. So how to upload in Padlet? But before that, let's take a look of my previous students' outputs in Padlet. Okay, for example, there, water cycle diorama. Here. Another one. Their wind vane. And their anemometer. Okay. So teachers can also post their video lessons and tasks for the students in Padlet. Okay. For example, this bulletin board. Okay, ginamit ko po ito last school year, fourth quarter. So, by week, uh, may nakapost po na video lessons and after that, yung mga tasks po na sasagutan ng mga bata. So, the students can actually download download the task here. Ayan, pwede nilang i-download kung gugustuhin po nila. So, dahil nga ngayon po ay naka online po kami, Ang gamit po namin ay Google Classroom. So, doon na po yan sa Google Classroom nila makikita. So, hindi na po namin to nagagamit yung bulletin board na to. So, gagamitin lang po namin ang Padlet today or for now para po maipakita ng mga bata yung kanilang outputs sa kapwa nila mag-aaral. Kasi sa Google Classroom, hindi po sila makakapagkitaan ng output. So, dito, para siyang uh, bulletin board, ito sa digitized bulletin board wherein they can share their outputs to other students. So, paano po gagawin yun? So, first, the teacher will post the link of their uh, Padlet. For example, this one. Click the link. Ayan. Recycled Materials Gallery. This is a gallery of all the recycled material outputs of grade for online classes. So, 2021-2022. So, there's a, uh, some instructions here. First, look for your grade and section. So, dahil tatlo lang po yung section ng online class, we have grade for Akasha, grade for Tangile, and grade for Yakal. So, bawat section, mapapansin po natin, meron siyang plus sign button. So, to upload your output or the image file of your output, click the plus sign button to upload. To upload. Ayan. So, pag naklik po natin, may magpa-pop up. Ito po yung mga pwedeng uh, i-attach. First, mag upload ng image. Pwede rin video. And this one, take a photo. And this one, link po siya. Kung halimbawa, mag-post kayo ng link ng YouTube video. Or, dito naman ay image search na magagaling sa Google or uh galing online and others. So, may marami pa po. So, dahil po ang gagamitin lang natin ay yung image file, image lang po ng kanilang output, ikiklik po natin yung first first one. Yung unang-una. Ito lang po. Ayan. Okay, pag naklik po natin, i-direct po niya tayo sa ating documents or sa ating downloads folder o kung nasaan man nakasave yung ating image file. Sa mga gumagamit po ng Android phone or tablet, same same lang po yung interface niya, same lang po yung makikita ninyo. Kung ano yung kiniklik natin dito sa laptop or desktop, ganun din naman po sa Android phones. Ayan. Click natin ang upload. Makikita natin, hanapin natin kung nasaan yung ating mga uh, or ating, uh, yung pictures na i-upload natin. For example, this one, recycled material. Halimbawa lang po ha. Ayan. So, hintayin lang natin siya na 
ma-upload. Ayan. Kunwari, uploaded na. Sa subject part, uh, depende po kung ano yung instruction ng inyong guro. Pero sa akin po, sa, sa mga students ko, sa subject part, hindi na natin ilalagay ang science. Kasi alam naman natin na science ang subject natin. At the same time, may topic din po da tayo dito na Recycled Materials Gallery. So, instead of subject, ang ilalagay natin dito sa subject part dito, 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 ay ang inyong pangalan. So, all capital letters. So, capital letters po lahat. Surname first, then first name. For example, Kilonia Genevieve. Yan. So, kapag na-input na ninyo yung inyong names, click the publish button. Ayan. So, makikita na rin po ito ng mga papasok sa Padlet at mag upload Just click the plus sign button. Kung may nakita na kayong may nakapag-upload na sa unahan, then dito pa rin kayo sa plus sign button sa ilalim nung nakapag-upload na. Okay? Ulitin po natin. Click the plus sign button. Unahe, ang unang gagawin, syempre, hanapin ang section na kinabibilangan. Grade for Akasha, Grade for Tangile, or Grade for Yakal. Halimbawa, Grade for Yakal, may nakapag-upload na. Then, yung susunod na mag upload click the plus sign button. Click the first one. Yung una. Ayan, first item here. Okay. Then, hanapin yung ia-upload. Halimbawa, eto, halimbawa lang. Ayan. So, hintayin na makapag-upload. Then, sa subject part, i-type or i-key in ang inyong surname, then first name in all capital letters. Halimbawa, Kilonia Genevieve. Then, click the publish button. Ayan. So, pwede nyong uh, bisibisitahin. Halimbawa, gusto nyong makita yung gawa ng ibang mag-aaral. And then, kung makikita ninyo, meron siyang heart react. Halimbawa, may nakita kayong gandang-ganda talaga kayo sa ginawa niya. Pwede ninyong i-click naman yung heart react to show appreciation naman doon sa ginawa ng inyong kamag-aral. Okay? So, yun lang. Ah, uh, Kung may mga katanungan, pwede pong i-PM si Teacher V. At kung bago ka lang sa aking channel, please click the subscribe button and notification bell to keep you updated. Okay, see you next video!